In this video, I'm gonna show you how to increase your sales for your online store by creating coupon codes. Coupon codes allow shoppers to get a discount when they apply the coupon code at checkout. This is a great technique to encourage shoppers to make a purchase when they're on the fence or even reward loyal shoppers with an exclusive discount. So I've created my online store with website.com and now what I wanna do is create my coupon code. So all website.com business plan levels include the capability to offer coupon codes and you can check your plan to see how many coupon codes are included with it and I'll drop that link in the description box. So currently I'm logged into my website.com editor and I've already created my store. If you need to create your store, feel free to check out our playlist on that topic to see how to make one. So now to manage my store, just click on the store icon on the left, then click manage coupons. Next, click add coupon. So we can go ahead and customize the coupon code and you can use this auto-generated coupon code that's right here. Generate a new one with this button, or I'll just type in a new one. So there are four different types of coupon codes, and I'll just go through all of them. So the percentage discount allows the customer to use the code to take a percentage off of their order total, off specific collections, or specific products. So here you can choose the discount value, and you can also choose if you want to have a minimum purchase amount before the coupon can be applied. If you scroll down further, you can apply this coupon code to the entire order, or you can choose if it'll work for specific collections. So if you click on it, you can choose which collections to apply it to, but right now I don't have any collections in my store. Or specific products, you can add or remove products. For example, if you wanted to apply to select products. So price discount allows you to take off a fixed amount. So for example, you can set it so the coupon will give the customer $10 off their total order or $10 off of each individual item. For example, I can make it apply to the entire order. So fixed price is a little bit different. Fixed price will allow you to offer customers a special fixed price for each product that it can apply to. For example, no matter what product it is, if they use a the coupon code, it would be $10 or $20, for example. You can choose to apply this as a fixed price for each eligible product, which is the recommended setting for this type of coupon code. If you like, you can set the coupon code to allow the customer to pay one fixed price as the total for all the products in the cart. So for example, if the fixed price is $10, even if they have one item or 100 items in the cart, the customer will only pay $10 total. And this would be a pretty extreme discount, so most store owners won't choose to offer this. Lastly, one of our most popular coupon codes is the free shipping coupon code. This code will allow shoppers to save on the shipping cost. And you can choose which locations are eligible for the free shipping code by choosing specific region rules. And I've already added different region rules, so I can take a look at them here. But if you want to set new shipping and tax rules for other regions, you can do that under settings. So I'm just gonna leave my coupon for now. And then clicking shipping and tax. And then you can add new rules up here. So I'll just go back and create my coupon code again. And I'm gonna to choose to make a percentage discount coupon. I'm gonna give a 20% discount with no minimum purchase amount. And I'm gonna have it apply to the entire order. So here you can choose if you wanna set any usage limits. And I'm gonna limit it so that the coupon can only be used once per customer. So the coupon won't work more than once for each customer email. And you can also set a start or end date for your coupon. And this is great if you want to plan a promotional campaign in advance, or if you want the campaign to expire on a certain date. And then once that's set, I'm going to click Save. So now my coupon has been created, and there are a few different ways to share your coupon code. For example, you can share it on your social media account, through customer newsletters, or even through a custom abandoned cart recovery email. 
The simplest way to promote your coupon code is directly on your website. And I'm gonna quickly show you how to do that. So I'm gonna click done. And you can see that this coupon is active. I'm gonna close this view. And now on my home page, I'm gonna click add elements and then add a strip. So I'm gonna quickly resize it. And then I'm gonna move it to the header section above my menu. I'll just move everything down a little bit. And then next, I'm gonna add a text element. Just click Add, click Text, and I'm gonna choose the Paragraph 1 styling. So I'll write, save 20% off your order with code 20 off. I'm just gonna edit the styling of the text first. click off of it and then click on it to move it onto the color strip. And I'll just make the font size a bit larger. And now my customers can easily see the coupon code when they're on the homepage of my site, which might entice them to make a purchase. So when you're happy with that, just click publish. So that's it for this video. Coupon codes are a great way to boost your sales for a successful online store. If you like this content, please remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel and thanks for watching.